I traveled thousands of miles magnet fishing with my boat in 2023. This video is a combination of seven days I spent magnet fishing a river in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Grab your popcorn and enjoy the movie. What is going on today, guys? Today we are back out here on the boat and once again we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing. All the way along the river there's tons of houses, tons of apartments, and there's also tons of factories. So the game plan for today is going to be to float down the river and just kind of drag our magnet as we float. I don't think I'm going to throw the anchor in on any one spot unless we really start laying into some cool stuff. Alright guys, so we're going to get right down to it here today. I'm going to head out in the middle of the river. We're going to start floating and dragging our magnet. And we're going to see if we can find anything here today. All right, guys, today we are back out here on the boat. I got my large 360 degree magnet with me. Now, like I was saying, guys, there is tons of houses and factories and all kinds of buildings along this river here. And as a matter of fact, we actually floated down this river in our kayak and right behind one of these multifamily homes, we saw what I'm pretty sure is a TV sitting in the water. And there was a whole bunch of other stuff too, but we couldn't get it because we were in the kayak so today we're going to be dipping our magnet down this river here and we're going to make a stop at that spot all right guys we're going to get right down to it we're going to start tossing around we're going to see if we can find anything here today oh i think i stuck something right here you can even see there's something else sticking out of the water some kind of big metal frame this is the spot where the tv is at and i can see it no kidding it is still here you guys i think i got something on here though hold on before we go check out the tv what did i just grab here oh yeah definitely something on there what is this first find of the day Dude, <laughs> you guys, check it out. I got me the old cartwheel. Or at least I think maybe that's off a cart. Maybe not. Holy cow, you guys. See, there's that TV. Let's go grab that thing. And there's a big old frame to something. I don't know what that is. Looks like maybe a chair. We'll grab that too. Holy cow, you guys. This is probably a little hot spot in here, man. It is right behind like what looks like a multi-family home. A little apartment deal. Do you see that, man? Holy cow, look at that. I don't even know if I can grab that with the magnet. We might have to bust out the claw. Actually, matter of fact, now that I say that, I don't even have the claw with me. Why do I do that? Why how do I do that? You guys, it is too, man. I can't believe it's still sitting here. This thing would probably stay here forever if I didn't grab this. Am I even gonna be able to get it? Yup, you guys, holy cow, man. Look at this thing. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to get it up. Oh my gosh, we gotta try it. Oh, that is literally what that is. That's a whole TV, dude. <laughs> yeah, there's no way I was getting this thing in my kayak, man. It was not happening, not at all. Oh my gosh, you guys, we got it in the boat. You guys, unbelievable, man. That is exactly what this is. This is a TV. Yep, look at, let's flip it around. Look at the screen. Holy cow, you guys. Wow, this is actually a pretty big one. Maybe a 40 something. Sheesh, dude. And this isn't like one of them flat screens. This is like an older school TV. This thing is heavy, dude. Absolutely unbelievable, you guys. We literally got a whole TV here. And then, you guys, right over here is another frame of something sticking out of the water you see this thing right here this is oh that's definitely a big old mattress cage but what is this this is like a chair frame or something hold on a second hold on buster a frame of something here a frame of what i don't know we're gonna find out oh my gosh dude it is a chair what the heck look at this thing man there's no cushion left on this thing or no fabric nothing it's literally just a metal frame. I'm pretty sure this water is super low right now because normally I don't think you would actually see this sticking out of the water like we did. I got a whole chair. I got to sit down in this sucker. Oh, oh, oh. She's a little rough, but not too bad, huh? We're chilling. All right, guys, we got the TV. We got the chair. Let's see if we can get this mattress spring here. Oh, my gosh. That's exactly what this is, too. Holy cow, dude. You got to be kidding me. And again, there's no fabric on this thing at all. So if you think somebody probably dumped an entire mattress in the river, it was probably 
years and years and years ago, man. There is so much stuff, and this is just what we can see poking out of the water, you guys. I can't imagine what else is under the water. Before we just start floating down the river and dragging our magnet, let's just toss around here a little bit and see if we can find anything. Why is that not working anymore? Oh, there it goes. Oh, what the heck was that? Was like I was on something. Oh, now we're clicking some stuff. Yeah, you guys, what do I got here? Here we go. First throw after finding all of that stuff there. Let's see what we got. What is this one? Dude, now, really? What the heck, man, look it. We got us another, what looks like a wagon wheel, but like, look at the difference. This one is super skinny. Holy cow, so these are obviously not off of the same wagon. <laughs> what the heck? So apparently there's a couple wagons in here. Unreal, you guys, we got us two wagon wheels. My goodness, again, it's like almost every throw in here. I at least hit on something. If I don't grab something, I feel some stuff. Oh, hold on. I feel something here. Ooh, this one feels pretty heavy too, actually. Oh my gosh. This is like really heavy. Whoa. What the heck? No. I think part of it came off, but I still have something. Whoa, red. What is that? Some kind of rag or something, but there's something heavy under there. What the heck is underneath this rag, you guys? Look at this thing. Hold on. Let me get this off of there. Holy cow. Look at that, you guys. Oh, look at, look at who's in there. No way. Come on. Come on. Come on. He does not want to come out. Come on. Come on, Frankie. Get out of there. Get out of there, Frankie. Come on. Come on. Come on. Gotcha. <laughs> you guys, look at, we had a little Frankie living in there. Look at, that's like the perfect home. But check out Frankie's home here. What the heck do you guys think this thing is? Looks like some kind of shell for something, I guess. Who the heck knows? Looks like it was bolted onto something. Kind of looks like some kind of car part to me, honestly. Pretty funky looking. And we got us the old red shop rag, you guys. Or wait a minute. No, that's not a shop rag. That's like a pink tank top. What the? Hopefully there's no swimmers down there to go with the tank top. How long do you think that sucker's been down there? My goodness, you guys. Ooh. Slammed into something again, dude. It's every throw. It's not even, it's not even every other or every couple. I mean, it is literally every single throw, you guys. What the heck do we got here now? It's not very deep in here. Maybe six feet or so? Whoa, whoa, what the heck is that one, yo? Hold on a second. First of all, looks like we got uh, maybe a big old piece of rebar here. Nothing too fancy on that one. But you guys, look at this thing. Hold on a second. This is really weird looking. I've never seen anything like this before, you guys. Look at this mechanism. What in the world do you think that is? Almost looks like some handlebars on here, but this part here looks like it might swivel or move around somehow. I don't know, you guys. That is a super duper weird one. What do you guys think that came off of? Definitely not a bike, I wouldn't think. Huh, super weird. Nah, really, again, dude. I'm telling you guys, literally every single throw. Where'd that go now? Right here? I think so. Oh my goodness, you guys. <laughs> no way. We got the old fork a -rooney. Now we just need us a plate and we can have us some river dinner. Screw the plate, we'll eat it right from the river. We got us a fork and what looks like uh, just a bunch of scrap, tons of nails, and maybe some little, little hinges or something. Can't really tell what that is. Huh. Oh my goodness, come up here. Oh, check it out, you guys. 
Yep, I I don't know exactly if that's what this is, part of a bed frame or something, but uh, we got her now, sea otter. You guys, it is absolutely unreal the amount of different crazy things that end up in the river. Oh, look at what fell off of there. <laughs> we got the old coat hanger, buddy. We can hang us up some shirts. You guys, there is some messed up stuff in this section of the river. Ooh, ooh, I just stuck something good there. What was that? No, no, no. I think it might have came off. Huh. That was really weird. Oh, no, I feel something on there still. What do we got here, you guys? This area is loaded, man. Oh, <gasps> whoa, buddy. Whoa, you guys, is that what I think it is? That looks like part of a handcuff. No kidding, that is exactly what that is. What, did somebody escape from prison and toss the handcuffs in the river? And look at what else we got, man. We caught us a railroad spike. The old cash money spike a Definitely way too rusted up. You cannot see the stamp on that one, you guys. Still super cool. You guys, I see some more stuff sitting on the shoreline here. Hold on. Look at this, see if I can get it. I think I got it. Let's lift it right up. I did too. You guys, <laughs> look at, I caught me the old pair of tongs. You guys, that's crazy. First, we caught us the fork. Now we got us the tongs. We got us a TV to watch the game on. And we got us a chair to relax in. Oh, we're living good up in here. Oh, what the heck is that? I don't even feel anything on there. Look at this. What in the world do you think of this little square looking thing? It's got some kind of hook on there. What in the world is that for, man? Something that hooks onto something. Oh, I stuck something there. What the heck is this one, you guys? Oh, oh my goodness, we're, we're dragging something and I'm lifting it up here. Oh my gosh, that's heavy, yo. What the heck is this? Oh, oh, nah, -uh. dude, <laughs> you guys, first of all, look it. We just caught us a super old shovel head. Look at that, the whole head is like still in pretty good uh, condition. There's like no chips in it or nothing. We're just missing a big old wooden handle. How old do you think this sucker is? Unreal, man, super cool. And check it out, we had us a big old crayfish hotel on here. See if we got any buddies in there. I don't see nothing. All right, a little bit of scrap metal cash money. Ooh, we got something we're dragging. Here we go, what is this? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow, why does everything feel so heavy in here? Whoa, buddy. Holy cow, hold on a second, you guys. What is going on here? Look at this thing. Um. I don't know what to think of this, you guys. We got some kind of big old long pole looking piece on here with whatever the heck is going on on the end here. I have no clue and it is pretty dirty and muddy here so it's kind of hard to tell. Nah. We just grab something, guys. Whoa, a little bit of white on there. Whoa, check this thing out, man. Hold on a second. What the heck do you think that is? It almost looks like some kind of small handle for maybe like some kind of cart or something, but then you see this little triangle hook looking piece in the middle and now i have no clue what that could be huh that's a weird one definitely got some white on there it sure does look like some kind of handle to me off of what who knows and 
Look at this, you guys. I thought, yup, and that is exactly what it is. Look at, we got us a tiny little wheel and it looks like maybe off of a small cart or something. That thing sure is tiny though. Ooh, something we just clung to pretty good right here. Oh my goodness, whoa, yo, what the, hold on a second you guys, looks like some kind of big old piping piece here or something, but look at this, what the heck in shapes is going on here man, you guys, what is this, like a yard trellis or something for uh, plants to grow on? It kind of doesn't even look like it. What the heck is that? Oh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Doesn't this right here look like a like a glove? Like maybe Santa's glove? Oh, maybe that's what that is, you guys. Part of a Santa statue or something? I have no clue. We caught us an arm with a glove. And we got us some kind of tube here with a bunch of holes in this thing. I don't know what the heck this one would be for. Some kind of pole for something. Oh, I thought there was something on there. Whoa, what is that, you guys? Oh, it's just a can. <laughs> Look at that, we got the old can of beans. Put some of those on the dinner plate once. Blech. Whoa, we're rolling over some stuff here. I grabbed something. Yeah, what do we got this time? Ooh, whoa, you guys, look at this thing. Now that's a great big old hook, holy cow. Is this one of them uh, gigantic like meat style hooks? Like the old butcher hook, you hang a big old slab of meat on there and uh, you can cut it up or do whatever the heck you're gonna do. I don't know you guys, but that is definitely some kind of big old hook, holy cow. Whew. What is that all of a sudden? Whoo! Is that coming up or what? Oh, yo! I just, I just grabbed something really, really heavy here, you guys. Nice and slow, like super slow. What the? Whoa! Hold on, dude. Whoa! Holy cow! Yo! What the heck is this? First of all, you guys, look at this big old, what looks like a rim or something, I guess. I really don't know what else it would be. It looks like a gigantic rim. I don't see no rubber on there though. Huh, some kind of big old ring. What do you think that one came off of? But look at this, you guys, we got us a little spring. I guess I shouldn't really say little, you guys. This is a pretty big spring, but compared to some of like the train springs that we find, this thing is pretty small. What the heck do you think that one came off of? We got us the old boing boinger. Boing, boing, boing. Let's keep tossing, see what else we can come up with. Oh, I got something here. Why does that feel so weird? I don't even really feel like I clicked. I'm just pulling something. That's kind of weird, dude. What in the world is going on here? Whoa, oh, whoa, dude, whoa. No, you guys, look at this. I caught a bottle and it's like stuck through like what looks like some kind of pipe or something. Holy cow, what are the odds of that, dude? Look at this thing, man. How old do you think that bottle is, you guys? What do we got, it's one of the old prohibition bottles? I doubt it. It's probably not that old. But holy cow, you guys, take a swig out of that one. And other than that, looks like big old piece of pipe here. You can see the pipe knuckle on there. Nothing fancy on that one. And looks like just a couple pieces of scrap wire. Oh, 
I landed on something there, guys. What do you think this one is? And see, we're right behind this auto body shop now and you can't get to this spot. You could never magna fish here unless it was from a boat, you guys, because you can't go in there. That's private property. Oh, what is that, yo? Oh my gosh. I got something serious here. What the heck? Oh, I see a bunch of bubbles. Whoa, yo. Oh my gosh, is that a sign? What is this? Dude, I think it is a sign. Holy cow, what is this hanging on there? Is that a piece of scrap metal it looks like? Yep, yep, hold on a second here. But this one here is a... Whoa, wait a minute, that, whoa, ho, ho, ho. Dude, no. Hold on, you guys, look. Look at what's on the back here. Doesn't that look like some kind of locking mechanism or something? Dude, this looks like a door to me now. Now that I see that, that's like some kind of, yeah, look it. This is like the, the handle. What is this? I see some paint on there though. Can't quite make out what this is. Ah, yeah, you guys, holy cow. Hold on, look it, see? That's definitely the flap to open some kind of door here. And you can see the locking mechanism on the back. What the heck do you think this is? Oh, shut up. No way, you guys. Look at who's trying to crawl out of there. Come on, Frankie. You can do it. Go on. Oh, we got him. This one's alive for sure, you guys. Frankie, we're taking your door. Go on, man. Holy cow, man. There is some absolutely wild stuff in this river. Look at our boat. Like, what the? What is that? Oh, 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 we stuck something good there. Is that gonna come up? No. Whoa, that's pretty heavy, dude. Come here. Oh, what is this, you guys? This is heavy, dude. What the heck is that? Oh, no, it's gonna fall. Stay on there, dude. What the heck actually is this? I can't even really grab it. Oh, oh, it's, something's falling out of it. What the? Hold on a second, you guys. Um, looks like some kind of box to me, dude. Yeah, what the heck is in here? Um, I don't see anything in there, you guys, but it definitely looks like some kind of box, like it's supposed to open like that. And then look at this, there's like a, what the heck is that? I don't know what this thing might have been attached to. Look at that, you guys, that is super crazy. Whoa, wait a minute. If you look at this end here, there's like some uh, hinge pieces right here where like it would hinge onto something. And then on the bottom, oh look, there's like a nut welded on there. Oh, and another nut over here it looks like. What the heck is this thing, you guys? That's really weird looking. Some kind of funky looking box. Weird. Here we go. No way, ooh. That stuck really good, dude. Oh my gosh. Again, man, still behind this auto shop, we are sticking some heavy stuff. What the heck is this? Whoa, buddy, hold on. Hold on a second. Oh, hold on, hold on, I got it, I got it. Dude, no, really? You guys, it's another one of them exact same type of boxes that we just found right here. Yes, this is literally the same thing. I don't know what these boxes are, you guys, but it's literally the exact same thing we just caught. Again, it's got the lid that opens and closes like it's supposed to. I don't know, dude. This boat is crazy, you guys. We are finding so much stuff. I think I just laid into something here. Yeah, you guys, I got something. What do we got here? Picked her right up off the bottom. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, hold on a second, you guys. Whoa. First of all, 
Look at this thing here. Ow, ow, ow. Probably some kind of fencing holder or something. Maybe a sign holder. A little bit of cash money. But, you guys, look at... Oh, wait a minute. I didn't even see that on there. Ha! We got us the old CO2 cartridge. But, you guys, look at this thing here, man. What the heck do you think this little thing is? It's got like a little nozzle on the top there. Definitely looks like some kind of container. What the heck? Oh, and then look at... I didn't even notice that. There's like some wires hanging off of it too. Definitely looks like something electrical now that I see the wire hanging off of there, but uh, I have no clue, you guys. Huh, that one is pretty crazy looking. I can just tell by looking at the shoreline, you guys, this shore is, the water's definitely super low right now. So a lot of stuff is exposed. <laughs> no, close, not close enough. Oh my, oh my. Oh, I just grabbed something at like the last second. Yo, what is that, dude? I just threw my magnet on shore to try and grab what's on shore there that I can see. But uh, look at this, you guys. I ended up grabbing this at the very last second there. What the heck is that, man? Bunch of coils in there. What do you think that came off of? It almost looks like some coils that you'd see in like a big old speaker or something. That's really weird, man. All right, see if I can get it now. Oh. Got it, boom, buddy. Landed right on it, bullseye. Uh-oh, 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 we're gonna crash into the tree. Uh-oh, if I can even get that sucker out of the mud now, that's the next problem. Come on, come on. Oh, I got it. I got it, you guys, no way, man. Look at this thing. I seen it just sitting on the shore there. Unreal, you guys. We got us the old kid's bike, the old rocket. Huffy. This thing couldn't have been down there for as long as some of the bikes we find. Holy cow, man. Should we ride it? Look at you can't even turn the handlebars. We'll just ride it like this. Oh my gosh. Unreal, you guys. Like seriously, look at all of this stuff we have today. What the heck, man? What the heck is that? I can see something kind of sticking out of the mud over there. Now we're getting up in tree territory here. This is where we start getting snagged. Ah, there's something there, dude. I can see it poking out of the water and I kind of half got it with my magnet. Hold on. Hold on a second here, bucko. Uh, no, that's not moving, yo. What is that? Almost looks like a car hood, dude. I'm telling you, it seriously does. You guys, I see something sticking out of the mud here and my magnet sticks to it, but I can't quite pull it out, man. It just slides right off, but it goes down pretty far. I don't know what on earth this is, man. Hold on, I gotta try and, I gotta try and work this thing out of the mud. Hold on a sec. Does that not? Look like the car, like the hood of a car to you? Dude, oh, shut your mouth. It is, oh, oh my gosh, you guys. I just found the hood of a car. Holy smokes, dude. You gotta be kidding. How am I gonna get this up? I don't think I can get that up by myself. No, you gotta be joking, dude. Hold on, let me walk it back, walk it back, walk it back. Uh, yup. Oh my goodness, you guys, you gotta be kidding. Look at it, it's literally the hood of a car. Oh my gosh, yo, no, come here. No, I'm losing it, no. Hold on, I'm gonna see if I can get this up on the boat. <sighs> oh my gosh, you guys, I just found the hood of a vehicle. <laughs> Holy cow, what the heck, man? And behind the old auto body shop, you guys, so it totally makes sense. Holy smokes, dude. I don't think we could fit another thing on this boat if we wanted to. What a day. Holy cow, you guys. I literally have no room to move. I have to climb over this hood just to get over to the driver's seat here. 
What the heck is going on here? This is probably one of the crazier days I've ever had magnet fishing before. I mean, I found guns, I found explosives and safes and you name it, some pretty crazy stuff. But dude, look at what we got going on here. This is, I, this is insane. <laughs> You guys, I seriously, I don't even have any words for today. The amount of different crazy things we're finding from the boat is just unreal. This thing is seriously changing the game. Just an absolutely crazy day. The back of the truck went from pretty much empty to pretty much full. Today, as you can tell, we are back out on the boat and we are gonna be doing some more magnet fishing. It is absolutely freezing out here today, guys. I mean, it's so cold, I haven't even started tossing yet and I already can't feel my fingers. I am seriously getting sick of this winter weather. Now this water is flowing super fast today, you guys. I have no specific plan for today. I have no certain location. I'm just gonna drop in the trolling motor. We're gonna float down the river and we're gonna drag this magnet. Check out this big old ship, you guys. The Algo Canada. Holy cow, look at that big red tank on there. No smoking. I can probably guess why. Holy cow, what do you think's on there? Gas or oil or something? Who knows, you guys? Wow, that is a big ship to see, especially when you're in the water next to it. Holy cow. All right, guys, today we are back out here. I got my large 360 degree magnet with me. And right now I have the anchor in and we are still being pulled down river, you guys. They definitely opened up some dams up river because this water is cruising. Plus we have wind gusts right now up to 30 miles an hour and I'm not even kidding. So it is brutal out here, you guys. Let's get right down to it. Let's start tossing around and see if we can find anything here today. Dude, seriously, look at this. Holy cow, anchor in, man. We are just absolutely cruising like uh, this is crazy this is almost not working <laughs> we're gonna get pushed right into shore here yep not good dude holy cow they need to close those dams that's what they need to do close them up for me oh my gosh man it's freezing look you see all this debris floating in the water here Eh, it's like a tornado came or something. No way. Dude, what the heck? You guys, I'm pretty sure in our very last video, I floated past the same area and I also found another fork. The heck, look at that one. That one's like flat like a pancake. What in the world? And that sucker looks pretty clean, man. You could go throw that one in the dishwasher and use it for dinner. Oh, you know what I just realized? We're not moving which is the first time we stopped moving since I put the anchor in. We must be hooked up on something. I am clicking on stuff again, you guys, kind of in the same area where we just pulled up that little shiny piece. Yeah, right here. Do I have something on? I do, dude, but the problem is going to be the current. Come on, there's some weight on there, too. Oh, yeah, whoa, yo. What the? Oh, and I see some white, too. Hold on a second. What is the white thing here? Uh, I don't know what the heck is that one. Some kind of pole, maybe off of some kind of patio set or something. Nothing too fancy. But check out this big old thing, dude. What do you think that says? No trespassing? Heck no, I don't think it says nothing. Or look at, maybe it did say something because you can kind of see what's maybe some paint under there, like some white paint. Can't really tell. It sure does look like it would be some kind of sign. We got the old sign looking with the pole on there. Dude, I think they're like opening more dams upriver as we speak. They gotta be. 
this is crazy. I've never before seen this river going this fast. I wonder if specifically it just gets really bad during the spring because there's so much water coming down. I'm sure that's what it is. Because during the summer, dude, it's never this fast. This, this is crazy. Oh, I'm hitting on something down there. I'm telling you, I keep feeling something down there. Doesn't really want to stick that great though. What is it? Come here. Come up. Come on. No, it doesn't really want to. Come on. It's kind of coming, but not really. I can feel myself slipping. Come on. Get up here. Did I get it? Oh, I think I stuck it, dude. I stuck something. Yeah, I think that's it. No, 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 no. Don't come off in the current. Oh my gosh. Ooh. I see a handle. Oh, hold on a second, you guys. First of all, big old chunk of scrap, it looks like. We got any writing on that side? Heck no. We got the old clam infested scrap piece here. But look at this thing here, you guys. What the heck is this thing with the handle on there? Look at that big old handle on there and uh, like nothing on the end. What is that? That can't be what it is. There had to be something on the end of there. I definitely don't think it was a shovel or nothing, but uh, what the heck do you guys think? Uh-oh, don't get that close. I'm gonna end up picking up my anchor. Then we're gonna go for a ride. <laughs> oh, right here. Wow, there must be a bunch of stuff right below me, dude. I got something again. Stay on there. Oh, something else popped off, but I think I still have something. Heck yeah. Oh, you guys, couple things. Oh, what the heck? Holy throw, dude. You guys, look at, first of all, we got the nine volt alkaline battery. Psst, psst. Look at that one. Long lasting. And check this thing out again. Another something with a big old handle on there, you guys. No doubt that one's a handle. You can see the grips on there. But what the heck do you even uh, think that is? It's just a handle with a with a pole coming off it. Oh, look at the pole like swivels. Huh, what the heck is that, dude? Now I'm really confused. And I seen some more color. What is this? Oh, the old CO2 cartridge. And look at it, it's still got some of the writing on there, just barely. Pretty cool. And there was some more stuff on here even. What is this big old thing? Oh, wait a minute here. I don't know what this could be, but oh, look at right here. There's like hinges inside this thing. So maybe these would, yeah, open and close. But this here looks like maybe some kind of handle would have went in there. And this is like maybe an old mop head. Oh, maybe that's what that is. Like the old school Swiffer head or something. Again, man, pretty cool. Hey, what if, what if this was like part of this? And that was, I don't know, maybe not. Could you imagine? Who knows? All right, you guys, we are finding some cool stuff already. I've been having a lot of audio issues too with this stupid GoPro, so hopefully uh, everything's working fine today. Oh, we just definitely grabbed something right there, guys. Heck <laughs> yeah. Nice and easy here. Don't get caught up on nothing. Cub to Papa. Uh oh no that's what i didn't want don't get caught up on nothing all right come here come here in the current no 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 gotcha what do we got here man yo holy cow you guys i found a lot of horseshoes before but look at the size on that thing we caught us some good luck No, no way. You guys, we found another fork. Second fork here today, but third fork at this spot. Super funky, you guys. It's gonna blow me right into it. Dude, get away from the shore. I wanna be close, but not that close, dude. You're gonna push me right into it. You're gonna beach me. 
Oh, what is that? I just grabbed something, you guys. Heck yeah. Stay on there, buddy. Stay on there in the current, please. Yes, dude. No way, you guys. Look at what it is, too. It's one of them big old meat hook looking things. Hold on a second. <laughs> we are going to crash. Hold on. Easy, buddy. If that anchor would just hold me. Yeah, look at this thing, you guys. This end's got like a loop on it, but that's like the pointy meat hook part. It's probably not for hanging meat, but it definitely looks like it's for hanging something, you guys. Super cool, man. Oh, going over top a couple things here. I'm feeling it. I think we got something. And we're gonna be blown right into the shoreline again. I got something heavy. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, yo. Come on, stay on there. Ooh, what's that big old rebar piece? Of course. Holy cow, man. Oh, hold on a second, you guys. It looked like we just had a bunch of rebar on there and we do two big old long pieces of it. But look at this, man. No way, you guys. Now we caught us what looks like a mini tight meat hook. It's almost the exact same thing as this one, only this one is like way smaller. That's super cool, you guys. What the heck do you think they were using these for? Oh, here we go. I just hit on something decent. Oh my goodness. Yeah, whoa. That's, that's going to come off in the current, I feel like. Or maybe not. Stay on, dude. This current is just fighting me today, man. Oh, stay on there, buddy. Oh, my goodness. What do we got here? Dude, nah. You guys. If you've seen our last video floating down this section of the river here, um, we found two of these things here and i don't know what they are but it's definitely a box oh <gasps> shut up look who's in there yo no we caught a fish you gotta be kidding me dude we caught us a literal fish look at what you doing fish actually that's not a fish you guys that is 100 percent what you call a goby and they're actually an invasive species and they eat fish eggs and stuff so i'm pretty sure legally you're supposed to dispose of these guys anybody else in there i don't think so i don't know exactly what this thing is but it's got some hooks on the bottom here and uh like some bolts welded on one side i don't know you guys this is super weird but this is now the third one of these exact type of boxes and i have a feeling this is probably not the last one in there and we definitely had a couple other somethings on there this one here kind of just looks like a big old ugly piece of scrap nothing too fancy a little bit of cash money but look at this one you guys we got a some kind of spring deal here this thing is packed with all kinds of gunk who knows what that one came off of boing 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 No, am I stuck on something again? Holy cow, man. The very next throw. It's like back to back in here. Oh, hold on, dude. Whoa, couple things. Yo, look at that throw, you guys. All kinds of stuff hanging off of there. First of all, that definitely looks like something off of a bike, like the part that goes over the chain. And a couple other things on there. We had some kind of green looking handle piece. What the heck do you think that one is? Little hole in the top there, nothing too fancy looking. This right here looks like it might attach to something. Probably some kind of handle for something, but off of what, I have no clue. Oh. I just landed on something, dude. <laughs> something pretty heavy. Oh yeah. Are we gonna be able to get this up even? Come on. Come on. See, I'm thinking the heavier stuff that they would have dumped in the river isn't gonna be very far from the shoreline here because they're probably not gonna be able to throw something that heavy very far. 
Oh no, 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 it's slipping. It's coming up, but it's slipping in this stupid current, yo. I got it. Dude, no. Are, you gotta be kidding me, man. You guys, we literally found us another one of these strange looking boxes. That makes a total of four of these suckers back here now. And I still don't have a clue what the heck they are. Super weird. Huh. Oh, I stuck something again, dude. Almost the exact same spot that I just pulled that box out. What do you think? We got us another box? No, could it be? I, I'm not gonna doubt it, not at all. Yeah, here we go. Super heavy, like, whoa, this is heavier than a box. What is this, dude? Whoa, hold on, yo. Oh, hold on, whoa, 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 a couple things. Oh no, there is another box, but there's something else on there too. Here we go. Holy cow, man, no kidding. Yup, it's literally another box on there. Hold on, we'll look at this thing in a second. But dude, another box with like some plastic wrapped up in that one. What in the world, man? Seriously, look at, <laughs> what the heck? And they all open up, like are these some kind of storage boxes? Oh, look at who's living in there. Frankie the Claw! You almost can't even see him. Look at, he's hidden in the mud. He can't even see. What's going on? Where, where you at? Where you at? Let me at him. Go on, Frankie. Dude, shut up. Hold on, look at another little Frankie. That's a baby Frankie. Oh my goodness, that's probably Frankie and the fam. Go on. Wow, you guys, I just, I don't even know what to think. They're all the exact same type of box. It's like some kind of little storage box or something. I don't even know. Now check this thing out, man. This one was pretty funky looking, dude. Holy cow, you got like a big old bolt on the top of that thing, but it's like some kind of, again, some kind of funky looking little box here. Look like maybe there used to be a tube coming off. Heck yeah, I can stick my finger right in there. I don't know if I wanna do that. Ugh. Oh, and look at you guys. This is part of that rubber tubing that we caught. So whatever this rubber tubing is, it's coming off of this piece here. What the heck do you guys think this one is? It, it definitely looks like some kind of auto part to me, man. Pretty funky, you guys. Is that come here no 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 stay on in the current oh yo look at oh it's gonna come off i got it dude <laughs> you guys no way man look at how far i mean i guess it's not that far out in the river but holy smokes dude we caught us a scooter man and look at that you think that's been down there for a little while or what my goodness now that sucker's old dude and it still turns skirt skirt we can do some scooter tricks up in the boat ready ready oh look at that they got the old fancy red shocks on there they were balling super cool man we got the old scoot scoot my wow that stuck pretty good dude what is that is that gonna come up hold on easy i think it might yep oh dude that like clung to the magnet and that's heavy oh my god dude no you have literally got to be kidding me right now, you guys. What on planet Earth? This is our fifth one of these mystery boxes, dude. At this point, I'm almost just expecting them to come out of here, but what are they? Oh, hold on. Hold on. I see a Frank and a friend in there. Oh my gosh, look at this one's a monster. Look, he's got mud on his eyes. He's freaking out. He's like, where am I? Where am I? Go on, Frankie all right behind the auto shop too man so i can't help but think that they gotta have something to do with that i am pulling something here you guys oh boy oh we got another box <laughs> it's heavy like a box dude no 
Ooh, something funky on there. Whole bunch of scrap for the most part, you guys. But what is this? What the heck do you guys think that one is? You can definitely see some gears on that thing, at least on this end. Oh, and the other end too. Look at that, some gears on this end too. What the heck do you think this little shaft looking piece is? Wow, that was like a sideways toss. I don't know how good that one's gonna work. Now we're fighting against the current. Whoa, <laughs> that wind gets to pushing, dude. Yep, our anchor just came loose. Oh, oh, like really loose. Whoa, whoa, slow down, buddy. We don't want to get smacked into the, into the what you call it there. Holy cow. Oh, a couple things on there. Dude, look, look at, couple scrap looking pieces, but what in the world is this? This almost looks like a shock, dude. Yeah, like for sure. Look at what the heck is on the end of there? A shop rag or something? Sure, <laughs> guys, there's literally stuff all the way down this river. Unreal. something out here at least i felt something for a second is it coming with us oh it is oh and that's heavy wow that's actually really heavy what the heck is that yo whoa holy cow first of all look at this big old pipe that's the jousting pipe right there all we need now is an opponent but you guys look what else was on there we caught us the old grill grate all right you guys we got the old grill grate and we got some forks to go with it we could be frying up some burgers in no time heck yeah dude I'm gonna get sick one of these days fishing in this cold weather, dude. I don't know how I have it yet. It is freezing. Oh, we got something again, man. It's it's seriously almost every throw. No, no, we're slipping in the current. Don't come off. I got it. Yo, no, 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 no. I see a wheel. I got it. You guys, what the? Hold on a second. What the heck is going on here? Is that a stick? Yeah, that's just a stick. But look at this one, you guys. We got something with the big old handle on there. Holy cow. And look at the end. There's only one of the wheels left, but you can tell there's supposed to be two. Obviously, this is some kind of cart or maybe used to be an old dolly or something. Look at this thing, you guys. You ain't hauling nothing with that cart no more. Oh, we are loose again. That anchor just keeps popping loose every now and then. Oh, hold on, buddy. Don't put us into the beach. Ooh, there's some weight. It's, uh, seriously, it's every throw. Every single throw. What's this one? Ooh, whoa. Yo, what the, hold on. First of all, Look at this one here. This looks like a big old pin piece for sure. But you guys, look at this thing, man. Yeah, holy cow, you guys. It's like rusted together. Oh, there we go. Now I got it. This is definitely a belt or something. You can see it swivels and everything, you guys. Holy cow. What do you think that one came off of? Look at all the teeth on that bad boy. Look at this cart. something again dude unreal oh yo what do we got here oh a couple things man first of all what is that a stick of dynamite <laughs> what the heck is that almost looks like again some kind of handle off of something but then again not really dude it's definitely painted you guys and i don't know if that's like a copper end on there i have no clue what the heck this could be and we had a couple other things on there, man. This thing here is what I saw. First of all, this just looks like a scrap pipe or something. But this one here almost looked like a key or something. I can't really tell. Yeah, dude, look at that. Oh, 
based on the way that the whole rest of this looks, is this some kind of old school vice grip? But you can see the threads on there, so obviously this isn't a key. It, it looks like it's a tightener. Ready? A horn, a two, a three licks to the center of the Tootsie Pop. Here we go. Last throw. What do you know? No, you're lying to me. Really, dude? What in the heck are these? Where did I put that other one? Oh, it's down in there. Give me that thing. Look at, whoa, dude. What the heck are these, man? Now we have two of them. They're the exact same thing. Like nothing different about either one of them. That is really weird, you guys. Oh. Something right here off the end of this tree. What is that? Oh my. I don't know what that was, but I don't think it's stuck. Oh yeah, what is this? Dude, whoa, whoa, you guys, look at that scissors. Look, it even comes with a rock stuck in there. <laughs> you guys, check out that pair of snippers. As rusted and crusted as these suckers look, I wonder if we could get these restored. Holy cow. Did I say I was only gonna do one more throw? <laughs> I don't wanna. I landed right on something. How can, how can, how can I leave? when I am just absolutely killing it here. Oh, oh, get away from me, Mr. Tree. Back up, we don't want to fight. I don't want to snap your twigs. We got something. I don't know, where'd it go? <laughs> we had something. Nah, I lost her. Lost her in the south. The old under the tree shot. Oh, you're getting awfully close to me, Mr. Tree. Back up off me here, I don't want to fight. Oh. See, that's what happens when you want to fight. You get your you get your limbs busted. I feel like I'm pulling on something, honestly. Oh yeah. Dude, we got something right here under the old tree shot. Oh. That's like doesn't that feels weird. Really weird. What is that, yo? Oh a rope! Shut up! I found a rope, you guys, and like a trident. I don't know what that is, but hold on, dude. Before we look at what we got on the magnet, look it, we got us a rope. What's on the end of the rope, do you think? Oh, it's coming up too. It's like actually coming up kind of easy. What the heck could be on the end of the rope? Um, where's what end here? I got it. What? in the world is going on here you guys looks like just a bunch of plastic garbage wrapped up in here the old beef snack stick wrap but look at that it's like literally a brick what the heck would that be about that is extremely creepy man to me it almost looks like there's something that might be in here that somebody wanted to sink really <laughs> weird man but you guys look at this thing holy smokes what do you think this one is it almost looks like a like a pitchfork or something, but we're missing some forks. I don't know what to think of that. What the heck kind of tool is this one, you guys? Super cool, man. And I thought I seen a little something else on there. Dude, no way, you guys. Look at what it is. We caught us a part of one of them super old roller skates. Definitely missing the front part on here, but super cool, you guys. I don't even remember what year these things are, man. You're talking like 40s, 50s, 60s, something like that. There is some old stuff coming out of this river. Okay, I gotta get out of here. So one more throw, this is it. I gotta go, man. I have to. I has to. I don't want to, but I has to. Again, it is literally every throw, and I am not exaggerating. I'm not kidding you. It is every single throw. Whoa. Yo, dude, is that a, a wheel? Like the rim off of something? Look at, you can almost see like writing on there. What does that say? Let's see if we can smack some of the rust off the letters maybe so we can see what the letters are a little better. Yeah, that one's an E for sure. That's like a P.
a C, an L. There we go. Now I'm starting to see what it is. I tried to bang some of the rust off of there and you can't really see it, but you, I can definitely read it a little bit better, you guys. I'm pretty sure it says eclipse. And I don't know what that means. It almost looks like there's another word up here. It's almost like some kind of hub, like it might go over the top of something. But it definitely looks like it would spin, man. That's gotta be some kind of like wagon wheel or something. Unbelievable, you guys. Look at this cart. Yet again, another absolutely crazy day out on the boat. It is absolutely beautiful out here today. It's 55 degrees. Now today we're going to be putting the boat in the river and Owen and I are going to be doing some magnet fishing. Today is going to be his very first day out on the boat and he's only ever even been magnet fishing I think like three times. So he's pretty excited. I'm pretty excited. We're going to get right down to it here today guys. We're going to put this boat in the river and we're going to see if we can find anything. Here it goes. Watch out, geese! Quack! Watch out, geese! Quack, quack! Watch out, birdie! Quack, quack! <laughs> Don't crash us into the ship! All right, guys, we are back out on the boat. Today, I have my large 360 degree magnet with me, and Owen is gonna be using the medium 360 magnet. We've been finding some seriously crazy stuff in this river, you guys, and there is just absolutely no telling what else is in here. You want me to throw it? Yeah, because I can't. Throw All right. Ready? Oh, you're gonna catch something now, dude, for sure. I think I feel something. My second throw here. I think I got something. Yeah, I got something here. Ready? Yeah. First find of the day. What's it gonna be? Whoa. Whoa, whoa, oh, what's the shiny thing? Hold on a second, first of all, looks like I just got me a big old ugly piece of rebar, nothing fancy on that one. Daddy, I think I know what this is. But yeah, what the heck do you think this one is, man? Daddy, I think it's a, I think it's like the bottom of the front of a car. You think it's off a car? Yeah. I think so too, man. I don't know what the heck piece this might be, you guys, but that sucker sure stayed pretty shiny. Definitely looks like it would slide over something. Huh. Got you got something on there? Oh, yeah. There's a lot of stuff in here, dude. Oh, yeah. Some yeah, pretty yeah. good stuff, too. Dad, you are right. You have the seat. Oh, my God, it's heavy. Pretty heavy. Let's see if you got something. Oh, you got a little something on there. What the heck is this? Oh, I got a bunch of stuff. Again, looks like a bunch more scrap, you guys. Maybe a little can top. Yeah, it's probably A sick. nail. Not sure. Looks like just some more scrap, buddy. A little bit of cash money for the cart. Ah! Does it feel heavy? Yeah. Yeah? Holy cow. Can you pull it? You need help? Yeah. Oh, you definitely do got something on there, buddy. Holy cow, you got a big something. What is it? Oh. Bro. Whoa. Oh. <gasps> Whoa, look at what's on there, buddy. What is that? Hold on a second. Looks like you got some... Uh... Oh, it's a piece of a shovel. Yeah, hold on, buddy. Look at, you got some big old cable wires or something here. This is definitely not even a piece of rebar. This is like a extremely long piece of this cable, like telephone oh wire stuff. God. Look at this. Holy cow. This thing's like, how big do you think that is? It's like 20 feet long, man. <laughs> like a hundred feet. Look at that, man. Just look at the size. <laughs> That's pretty crazy, buddy. The size of it. Nice find. Yeah. I think this is for gardening. Yeah. Nice. Throw it in. It's moving by itself. My leg never moving by itself. Holy cow. Bro, I think it's stuck. Bro, You want something again? I think I'm a, I, dude, I have something too. I'm telling you, this is a little hot spot. We found it. We found the little hot spot. Whoa. What is this, dude? What do you got? Anything? No. Nothing? 
Hold on, we're gonna crash into the shore. I got a whole bunch of something on here. Look at this. I don't know what the heck I got going on here. It almost looks like a, is that a, is that a, oh, it's a rope, I think. Like a gigantic rope. I almost thought it was like a t-shirt or something. No, oh, you know what this is, I think? What? I can see the knots on the end. I'm pretty sure this is like a dog's, like, tugging toy or whatever the heck you call yeah, it. Yeah, it's a... It's like a dog's chew toy. Ha! Yeah, and you, like, hold on to the other end. Yeah, yeah. It's for playing tug of war with the dogs. Run. The old tug of war toy. Who? <laughs> Who? Ooh, um, I just landed on something. Like, immediately. It's still on there. Hold on, buddy. We're gonna smack into the shore. What? Driving this thing is half the battle doing this. Half the battle? Half the battle. Yeah, I, don't, I think I got something. Oh. oh, I do have something here. Oh, I think I got something. I feel a little weight anyways. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. What the heck is this? Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. It's looked like just a plain old metal ring here, but look at you can definitely see some rubber on there. Look at that. You think that's like some kind of old wheel? Yeah. Maybe off an of old school wagon or something? Huh? That is super old looking. Pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, my magnet was moving by itself again. Oh, I just stuck something hard. Oh, and it's coming with. Oh, whoa, what is this, you guys? Oh. That's pretty heavy, dude. It's, it's like it. spinning. Oh my god. Um, what the heck is that, yo? Yeah, dude, it's, it's like a like a rock. I don't even know what to think of that. That doesn't even look metal. I don't know, you guys. This does not look like any kind of metal I have ever found before. I seriously think this is some kind of funky looking rock. Oh. The old magnetic rock pancake. You're pulling us right to something here. You got something on? Yeah, I think so. Is it coming up? Need help? I have. Oh yeah, you got a little something on there pulling. Here it comes. What the heck do you got this time? Oh! Ooh, whoa, yeah. dude! That's a big hook! You know what this is? What? I guess I really don't know what it is, but That's I've- I've caught a few of these. Nope, it's not a crowbar. You guys, I have found tons of these in this area back here. And uh, I guess I don't know exactly what it is yet, but look at you caught one of these big old meat looking hooks. It's got the pointy hook end here. And this hen looks like you'd hang it on something. I don't know, man. Daddy, Daddy, I promise this is a crowbar. No, it's not a crowbar, buddy. It almost looks like it though. It's close. You got yourself the old hookaroo. Oh, stuck something right there. Whoa! Heck yeah. Hold on a second. Oh, we're gonna smack. Yeah, right there, dude. Nice and easy. Oh, it's coming up out of the mud. I got something here, dude. This is heavy. Whoa. Whoa. What the heck is that one, man? It almost looks like some kind of old school window frame or something and it could be actually look at this building here this old abandoned building with all the smashed out windows we caught us a big old cash money window Ooh, right here something on there oh that's got some decent weight what do i got here guys what is it Oh, whoa, dude, what the heck is that? Is that a, is that a bike frame? Yeah, I think so. I think it is, dude, holy cow. You guys, look at this frame. Yeah, look at, this is where like one of the tires would go right here. Yeah. Oh my gosh, not a handlebar, not a bike seat, not a pedal, not nothing. My goodness, you guys, this one had to be in here for like 50 years. My goodness. I just stuck something there, but we are flying to it. I don't even know if we're moving or if it's moving. Oh, it is moving. Here we go. Yo, now that's heavy. Holy cow. What is this? Whoa. 
Look at this, buddy. Holy cow. Holy moly. <laughs> Holy moly is right. What the heck do you guys think this one is? Look at all the gears and teeth on there. Now that's a cool piece. You guys, I'm not 100% sure what this building used to be, but I think it was automotive something. And looking at this piece here, I'm not 100% sure what this is, but my guess would be something automotive. Holy cow, that thing's huge. That's pretty cool looking, huh? Yeah, it looks like a microscope. Looks like a microscope, kind of. <laughs> All right, guys, we just seen something on shore here. Definitely looks electronic. We're gonna see if uh, we can pick it up here. Owen's gonna try and grab it with his magnet. Hold on. Right here. I got it. There. <laughs> Dude, look at this thing. What the heck do you think that is, man? Got a big old cord hanging out here. Should we plug it in? <laughs> Obviously, this is some kind of motor piece or something but it's got like all kinds of gauges and knobs on here. And look at this thing, it's like a glass bulb. What the heck is this? Look at this, there's a switch on the back. You could definitely turn this thing on and off and it plugs in. I, I'm not even gonna try it, you guys, but I wonder what the heck would happen if I plug this sucker in here and tried to turn it on. There's like some kind of hook on here. I don't know, you guys, super crazy looking piece. I don't, are those suction cups? Chips are in my backpack. <clears throat> you can get them. I think I'm pulling something here, guys, and we're slingshotting ourselves right into the shore. Yeah, I'm definitely pulling something. This has got some weight, and I remember fishing this area in the kayak, and I know for sure there's some kayak flippers in here, man. So here's one of them. Oh, oh boy. Oh, no, it's slipping. There it goes. It fell right off. Whoa. Oh, there's still something on there, though. A couple things, anyways. Oh, look at what I just found. Oh, it's only one part of a scissors. Still pretty cool. But check this thing out, you guys. I don't know what this is. It definitely almost looks like some kind of pulley piece, like you could run some rope on there or something. Well, check that one out, you guys. What the heck do you think that one could be? And I think this one on here was just a big old piece of, or no, I was gonna say a piece of rebar, but it looks like we got a big old steak. Ching, ching, ching. What do you got there, buddy? Oh yeah, look at that, man. You got yourself another kind of hook. This one's not as big as that big meat hook you caught, but it kind of looks like it, huh? Another some kind of hook that you'd hook onto something. Oh, you know what this is? It's the old hat hanger. <laughs> No. <laughs> it's right in there. Let's see if I can put the magnet on it. Oh, I hit it, dude. I literally landed right on it. Pull that sucker in nice and slow. Yep, it's on there, dude. Oh I connected to exactly what I thought. I just... Is it stuck? No, I think I got it. Keep pulling. See if we can get it in. See if it's what I think it is. <laughs> Keep pulling. We got it. We got it. It is on there. Is it what I thought? Dude, it is. What is it? Look at it. It's uh, what do you call this? A tire iron. No, this is for like changing tires and stuff. Oh, That's crazy. I seen it sitting in the mud from that far away. I'm like a hawk. Come on. I got you got another beast. Yes. Well, here we go. I grabbed me a little something. Or should I say a big something? This is kind of heavy. The heck is that? Uh -huh. Whoa, whoa. That's not no average piece of rebar there. Oh, what do you got there, bud? What the heck is that? It looks like a rainbow. A rainbow? Now, is it that Check big? this thing out. Oh, look at that. It's like some kind of, like a fender. A small fender looking piece. Look at that. There's like uh, flaps on the inside here. What the heck do you think that came off of? Mm -hmm. Maybe a small trailer? It could be. That looks like the fender that goes over the top of the wheel, like the wheel well part. 
You guys, what the heck do you think this came off of? Obviously, this looks like some kind of handle for what? I have no clue, man. And there's a little bit of something else on here, but not a whole lot. This thing, what is this? What the heck is that? Hey, dude, no way. Oh, hold on. You got something on there? Yeah, we'll check this out in a second. That's super cool. You need help? Oh, yeah, dude, you got something here. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. You got something. There's some weight on there, dude. What the heck is this? Ooh. Oh. Whoa. Oh, look what's on there, dude. It's a knife. It is. Holy cow. Careful. Put you want to pull it off? You can pull it off. Just be careful. There you go. Let me see. Holy cow. Check that one out, you guys. Oh, it's a pocket knife. Heck yeah, dude. That's a nice find. Give me some knucks. All right, dude. Super cool find, man. How long do you think that was down there? Like a hundred million. Like a hundred million years. I think so too. Pretty cool. All right, you guys, we got to check this thing out that I caught. Yes, this is exactly what I thought it looked like. It's like some kind of action figure. You can tell it's like a guy sitting on what looks like a horse. I knocked off a little bit of rust, guys, but I don't want to hit it too hard because uh, the head already broke, so I'm sure the rest of it will break pretty easy. But still super cool. We found us a little action figure riding a horse. Is that like an old school toy from back in the 50s or something? Or probably back in the hundreds. Back in the hundreds. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, look at this. I was just going to clear my magnet. This one just looks like a piece of rebar or something. Nothing fancy on that. But... Look at this little thing I had on here. It's like it's got a little loop on there. What the heck do you think went on there? Yeah, look at there's like little hooks on the end. So it definitely hooked on to something. What the heck is that? Some kind of tiny paint roller? I doubt it. I don't know what to think of that one, you guys. Super funky. There you go. Yeah, I just on you it. got it. Yes, I got it. I got it. There you go. Pull! Oh! Oh my goodness. Uh-oh. We are smacking on the rocks here. I think it might be stuck a little bit. You need some help? Yep. Hold on. Hold on. I'll grab it. Oh. We got the paint. <laughs> Holy cow, buddy. We landed right on there. You landed right on it. What kind of bike do we even got? What is this? Team mm, something? That's crazy. Oh, did I just land on something? Yeah. Either that or I'm wedged because uh, we just stopped in our tracks. Oh, that's not coming off. Oh, we got something. Hold on, hold on. We're going to crash. I got something on here, though. If I can get it up. Nice and easy. Oh, we are going to crash into this tree. Get out of here. Come here. Dude, whoa. What is this? Oh, my goodness. That's, dude, this is really, really heavy. That's not gonna come up, is it? No, it's gonna come off. No, I got it. Oh my gosh, dude, no. -uh. Oh my gosh. Oh. It's the whole Holy bike. cow, man. It's the whole bike. <laughs> What's that? What the heck is it? I got a bike. The whole bike, the whole bike yeah? Watch your head, buddy. Uh, I think it's only like 10. Yeah, no, you're good. Yeah. You're good. I'm, I'm, uh, I got a YouTube channel, so I'm used to it. The Fisher. He said he's going to take some pictures of me and hopefully he didn't want me to get mad or something. I don't know. It sounds like he's going to call the police on me or something. I don't know. It sounds like he got, might have something to hide. You guys, absolutely unreal though. A, a whole mountain bike. Look at this. Yep. Oh my gosh. Unreal. Like, can we keep it? Yeah, we're keeping that one. Look, we got a big old plastic bag stuck on the bottom of there. That's always good to get out of the river. I don't see any fishing lures hooked up in here though but i guess we wait we are way out here so i don't even think anybody comes out here to fish anyways pretty crazy man yeah what do you think good good oh my gosh yeah look at oh my cow dude yeah, we're getting too much stuff. 
I got something. Can you close this on No, nope, it won't close. It's too dirty. We gotta clean it up. Okay. I got something here. My gosh. Yeah. This one's got some weight. Oh, oh no. Oh, it got a little bit lighter, but I still have something. Okay, I think almost got pushed me off the boat. Whoa. Look at this thing, dude. What is that? Yo, is that an iron? Yes! Look at it. Holy cow, that's like a super old school iron, I think. Guys, yeah, yeah, I think that was back in the in the 2000s. <laughs> that is crazy. I That is an iron, you guys. Look at it. It's in, it's in the exact shape of an iron, and you can still see where the handle was. Holy cow, man. Now that is super cool. What do you think the year on something like this is? Unreal. You got something? Oh, you did get something. Let me see. Hold it up. Oh, yeah, you got something on there. That's cool. Check this out. But that looks cool. That does have a funky design. You know what I think this is? What? I think this is oh, part... Oh, I think I know what it is. What? I think it's a piece of the stove. Dude, you're right, because that's exactly what I was going to say. I think it's a piece of a stove burner or something. Yes, I think that what it is. Good guess, buddy. That's exactly what I was going to say. Yeah. Holy cow, what if, what if there's a whole stove down there? <laughs> we could cook some river stew. Oh, here we go. Now I got something. Oh, dude, this is heavy. This might be the thing that popped off. Whoa, yo, what the, dude. Holy cow, man. What the heck? <laughs> Daddy, I think I know what that is. It almost looks like a big ladder, but I don't think that's what it is. Yes, it is. I don't think so. Oh, you know what this is? What? This is part of a hand railing. Again, another piece of bag here. I don't think there's anything in there. It would sit like this, and this is the part that your hand would run along. Holy cow, man. I'm guessing this probably came off of whatever this building used to be. <laughs> what in the world, man? I probably couldn't even lift that. This is nuts. That blue like stuck, huh? I know. Look at that. That's insane. Now you're right. Huh. You have the secret spot. <laughs> I wasn't kidding. I thought you were joking. It's like the real money. You having fun? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to school, then I'm going to tell my, my teacher that, that, I, that I... Oh, look at this. I don't even think we had anything on there. What is it? But look at, you know what this is? This is like the heel off of an old shoe. Holy cow, man. That sucker's got to be super old. It's literally just the heel part. You could go tap dancing. On some wood. Oh, careful. <laughs> Oh you got something on there. What do you got there? Check it out. Oh, look at what it is, buddy. Looks like a big old piece of rebar here. But look at what this is. You caught yourself a little brick pad. Doesn't look like there's much on there. No wonder that sucker ended up in the river. <laughs> well, holy cow, dude. Look at this cart, you guys. Over the top full. What do you think, man? We killed it, huh? Yeah, we killed Gave it. Gave some nuts. We killed, like, the whole boat. We killed the whole boat and the river. Time did you launch the boat at? Uh, it was maybe noon. Okay. Sweet. And then last question, zip code? Uh, What'd you do? If you don't want me, I, you I cool? found all yeah. kinds of stuff. Yeah. It's... You never know what you're going to find. A yeah. couple, couple bikes. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Thank you for cleaning up the rivers. Yeah. I have a magnet too. And Is it? I do need to use it. I just, I've used it a couple times. Oh. I bought it a few years ago. A lot of people it's, are interested. It's, it's cool. It's uh, yeah, the coolest know. item you ever found. Uh, guns. Okay. Explosives. Yeah. Stolen safes. Yeah, stolen, okay. All kinds of stuff. Stolen safes, any of them ever close? No. Okay. Unfortunately, no. <laughs> no.
do you need to get your feedback on any of the guns at all? Do they ever like no? Back Most of them? the time now, they just tell me keep them. They don't even want them. Yeah. Pretty weird. Yeah. I'm curious. Did somebody call? No, no, no. So what I did, somebody was taking pictures of my boat, and he seemed a little no, suspicious. Uh, so, so what I do is interview. Uh, what my main <clears throat> focus is on people that are fishing. So I figure out what the people are fishing for, and then. Um, get, get data if they're harvesting fish. I might take okay. samples from the I've had a run in yeah. with somebody in a different town before. I guess yeah. it was the same kind of deal here. So, yeah, yeah. So, that's just what I'm doing. Okay, um, cool. No, that's just, I just, I'm just kind of curious. Why. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> pretty cool. Nice. Well, good work. Yeah. 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 Cool. Thanks. Have a good one. Yet again, you guys, we absolutely killed it. And today was Owen's first time out in the boat and he is absolutely beat. We filled that cart over the top, you guys. We had the boat leaning, but that's weird, you guys. They're starting to survey us. They're trying to find out how many people are magnet fishing. Next thing you know, there's going to be a magnet fishing license you need. I'm telling you, it's going to come or something. Today we are back out in the boat. Alex is out here with me and we are going to be doing some more magnet fishing. Now the spot we're going to be magnet fishing here today, there's like a ton of factories here. This big old white building back here is a factory. This brown building behind it is a factory. We got a big bridge here and then on the other side of the river there's some more factories. So there is just no telling what the heck we're going to find here today. Let's get right down to it, start tossing our magnet and let's see if we can find anything. All right you guys Guys, today I have my large 360 degree magnet with me. Let's get right down to it, start tossing and see what we can find here today. Now right off the bat, you guys, like I was saying, I can see stuff on the shore here and I'm not even kidding you, watch this. I'm gonna see if, oh, avoid the rocks. Watch out for the rocks and socks and stuff. Here we go, let's see if I can, I got some stuff here. I'm not even kidding you. Let's see how close we can get to shore here without beaching ourselves. Look at, I already got something, man. And look at, can you see all this stuff? Look at, what do you say? It's car parts or something? Like, look at, what is that, dude? Holy cow. Okay, first of all, let's see what we got on here, you guys. Look at this. You guys, look at this thing. That is very unique. Is, is there like cushions or bushings on there? What the heck is a what? <laughs> like a oonga. A oonga, oonga. <laughs> oh yeah, look at there's wires hanging <laughs> like out of there. A horn, man. What the heck is going <laughs> on here, no you guys? Idea, like a bushing and there's a little on, hook. Man. I don't know what to think of this, but I thought it almost looked like there was another one in there. But what else we got on here? Holy cow, looks like not a whole lot. Just a bunch of debris for the most part. You guys, I had something on and then it fell back in the water here. I don't know, see if I can just stick my hand in here and reach for it. Where did it go? Right there. This thing, man. <laughs> Look at that. What the heck is that? That is weird, man. Look at the handle on there. It almost looks like a grenade handle. Tink. It almost looks like uh, some kind of like an insulator. Maybe like an old school telephone pole insulator or something. That is really weird, man. It's got some kind of handle on there. Huh, super crazy. I'm gonna see if I can jump over here. Huh, huh, huh. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. I'm doing the splits. I'm doing the splits. Oh, oh snap. <laughs> Dude, not good. Oh, we're good. We're good. Whew. All right, you guys, I'm gonna try and grab some of this stuff like this here. Look at this. Yeah, dude, it's like some kind of cog piece or something. You can see the teeth on there. That's way too heavy to have come off a bike. Was there one, two, three sets of teeth sure, on there? Right, for different huh. gear sets, I'm sure. That's crazy. Oh, what is this here, dude? Like a... Whoa, look at that. Whoa, see? This is some kind of insulator. Yeah, yeah. Like I've, a, I've seen you electric ins up yeah. With the magnet. Yeah. And I think those are actually holy cow. This though. one's definitely broken and sure. smashed yeah, up, yeah. but holy no, cow, dude. I do dude. remember that. I think you found that on that railroad bridge that one. I don't even there. remember. It's I think like, I found a couple. Oh, oh wait. There's another one over there. There's two of them. Bro. This thing? Yeah. And then there's another oh yeah, and there's another one here. Check these things out, you guys. Ouch. What in the world do you think these are? Here, you take like, this one. These are literally the exact like same thing. Ball hitches or something? I don't know, but this part swivels. Yeah, well, yours does too. anyways. Yeah, definitely the exact same thing. Huh. Looks like it's got a little bit of writing on there. Maybe a couple yeah, numbers or letters. U.S. patent. You guys, look at it. It's got like a pin here you can pull out and you can like 
it looks like you can take this pin out and take the ball off sure, of there. Right, yeah. It's like some kind of hitch or something. Oh, that is really weird, man. And we got two of them. Yep. You guys, there's so much stuff just sitting on the shore here. This is nuts. Oh, look at that. I see something kind of cool looking. Ouch. Look at this, dude. Whoa. You guys, look at this flipping thing. What the heck is that? It's like a handle on there with like, I don't even know. Hold on. Oh, oh. It's a Tesla coil. Look at that. Yeah, what the <laughs> heck is that, dude? It's gotta be parts for a power line. We got insulators. We got the coils you on You think? There. Some it old power be, line dude. parts? That's, it's just another guess that I'm shooting from the hip. You guys, look at some coils on each one of these things here and it's definitely got some kind of handle man i don't know that is super crazy looking you guys look at i mean you can just see all the metal just sticking out of this like look at here's another one of them hitch things with the ball another one of the hitch things with the ball here and look at what is this here aha this is like one of them telephone insulators For sure. or not a i don't know if i say telephone insulator it's like an electric pole insulator right. Now, I know, I remember some of the comments saying that they can be glass, too, and I have... I think that might be I, what this is. You think so? I, I don't just, think that's, like, metal. Uh, Maybe. I don't like know. It's, stuff, it's hard to yeah. tell. Yeah, it's I don't like know. toilet bowl material or something. Huh. And you guys, we, I, I think we could sit here for hours if we really wanted to and keep plucking stuff out of the mud because look at this. If you look up in this tree, dude, I kid you not, up under this tree... Look at there is literally more insulators stuck up under this tree. Look at there's like one, two, maybe even three of them up under there, dude. And then this, what is this? Something here too. Uh, let's see if I can pull this out of mud. I don't think I can. It's like stuck up under the tree, dude. There's some crazy stuff going on here. Oh, you guys, what the heck is this one? Look at that over here. Oh, that's like stuck in the mud. Oh, I got it. Yo, look at this one. These gotta be oh, insulators, man. dude. Like, look at this one's like still it. attached to the wires this yet. Is the same material as we were just not. Yeah, before. this is like the same insulator material there as one of them other insulators. Like so Definitely a lot of electrical stuff going on here, you guys. We have tons of these funky old school looking insulators and what seems to be like some telephone pole looking stuff. Unreal. All right, let's start tossing the magnet around here a little bit and see what else we can come up with. Oh, we're going under the bridge. I don't know about this. Oh, it's actually kind of deep under here. Whoa. Oh, I'm getting caught. Dude, I got something. Dude, really? Yeah, oh man. Uh, I was almost skeptical about even dragging my magnet under the bridge and now I got something. Holy cow, that's heavy. What the heck is that? Oh, what the heck, you guys? Look at I know it's kind of dark under here, but look, I got one of these big old L-shaped brackets that we always find by railroads. What the heck is that doing under here? Oh, and look at what else is on there, man. The old shiny fingernail clippers. All right, guys, we cost the old two for one here. Nothing too super crazy. We got the old train track bracket piece and the old fingernail clipper rooskies. See, now we're coming up next to this factory here. I have a feeling this is gonna be pretty juicy, you guys. Uh, I don't know, I have no idea. Oh my gosh. Whoa, dude. I got something heavy. Look at all the bubbles. Oh yeah, dude, that came right out. What is oh, this? Holy cow. Oh, hold on. <laughs> You're gonna flip us over. Dude, I can't. What the heck is that? Oh my gosh. Am I gonna even be able to get this? Whoa. Whoa. Dude. Oh, a couple different things. Oh different my things. goodness. Wow. What the heck is this, man? Oh, get up here. Get up here. Get up here. I think I'm like attached to a tree branch or something is what's going on. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, you guys. What the heck? Holy cow, you guys. Look at what I just grabbed. What do you even think that is? It's got like, 
legs on it or something. I don't know, some kind of frame piece for something. That's not even gonna fit in the cart. Unreal, you guys. Some kind of big old frame type piece. Um, I am literally attaching to something in the smack dab middle of the river, dude. Like, that's heavy. No, oh, I just restuck to it, like hard. No, nope, and now it's coming off again. It's slipping. Come here, I got it. Here it comes, dude, what the heck is this, man? This should not be coming up, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, this should not be. What the heck is this? What the? <laughs> dude! What in the world? Holy cow, hold on a second. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh my god. Uh, like a lever or something. Yo. What in the oh yeah. World, bro. There's like some kind of like, is that an electrical box on there? Looks like it. Controls for whatever that What the is. heck is this, man? It's like some kind of big old circle disc on there too. You guys, look at this big old thing. It's got some small little disc at the top, but that is a big old disc at the bottom. And I don't know if this is like some kind of electrical box hanging off of there or what, but this here is like, yeah, it's floppy. like a, yeah, it's floppy like a rubber okay. cord or something. Is there wires? Can you see? Going I don't know. There might be wires in there. I can't quite tell. I declare this magnificent territory. I don't know you guys, what the heck do you think? is this yo look at this thing you guys look at that man i don't know if those are like oh what the heck those are like oh, rubber just... rubber something going on here rubber caps for something i can't really tell you guys that is crazy looking what do you think that is i don't know if that's some kind of switch or something what the heck what the heck is this now hey that's one of them big old meat looking hook hangers oh really yeah so? look at it. it's like one of them s curve hooks and that one's got like a pointy tip on it so you can i don't know i call it the you meat hook hang an animal from i don't it. know really? but i find them all up and down this river that's dude like literally wild, everywhere man. i believe you i'm sure you that's know crazy more about something like this than i would here but i really hope this wasn't a meat hook it's kind of unsettling <laughs> but for me you guys we got some more scrap right here oh i got the something the cart is starting to stack up here dude all around me oh my gosh this like is heavy yo oh holy god. cow dude dude <laughs> oh my gosh what that oh that's a chain yes. i couldn't figure out what the heck is going on here i think there's a couple things in there Oh my gosh, you guys. Yeah, look it. Look it. Ooh, I caught me a horseshoe. Yeah, bro. We caught us a little bit of good luck. You guys, holy cow. We caught us a little horseshoe. <gasps> bro, that's an airplane. What? That's cool. Look at you oh, can see the man, wings. Yup, that's like some kind of old model airplane. What? That's so cool, man. That's super cool. Oh, JJ, man. Heck yeah, <laughs> dude. <laughs> JJ. <laughs> there needs a little propellers on there. Needs <laughs> and propellers. That's all it needs, man. You guys, if you want to see me clean this up, we're definitely going to restore this over on my restoration channel, The Fisher Restoration. You guys, that is so cool. I wonder what the year is on this thing. If you look close, it almost looks like obviously these are wings. This is obviously the tail. But these look like ears. Like it almost looks like it might be a some kind of animal plane or something. I don't know, dude. That is so weird. But the coolest part about it is that the only thing that looks like 
is missing is the propellers. None of the wings are broken on the back or on the sides. You guys, this thing is in like decent condition. I love finding old little antique things like this. That is super cool. <laughs> But you guys, we also had this big old chain piece and I don't know what's wrapped up in here, you guys. I think just metal shavings. Just a big old bunch of metal shavings there. But what the heck do you think this chain link came off of? Look at the size of this thing. This is like a ship size chain link. I don't know if back in the day they used to float super big ships down this river. Maybe this is like a chain off of an anchor from a ship. Who knows, you guys? Oh, and look at this, dude. What? I didn't even notice oh, this. Yeah, well, I don't know if it's an extension cord, but uh, part of a cord here. I got the plug. Who knows what the heck that came off of. Maybe it goes to the electrical box for this big old something stand we got. I got some more weight on here. That was quick. Yo, what the heck is this? Dude, you have got to be kidding me. I found another horseshoe. You guys, look at the size of that one. That one like fits in my hand, but it looks like it's in super good condition. It's like hardly even rusted up, man. We caught us some more good luck. Plus, I don't know what this one is. Is this maybe some kind of cover for something or is this maybe like a bowl? Cause look at, you can see there's like pouring lips on there on both ends here. And then this is almost like a handle. Like you could fill it up with something and Pour it out. Is that maybe an old school ashtray? I have no clue. Oh yeah, dude, for sure. I think you're absolutely You can see right. the couple lips on yeah, there. For like um, cigars. Something. The stogies, man. That's super cool. All right, four, yeah. I don't even Oh, look at that one, you guys. What the heck? I think this is just a big old piece of rebar, but look at this thing. I got another, some kind of gear piece with all kinds of teeth on there, man. Well, check that one out, you guys. That one's a thick old gear piece. There is some pretty funky stuff coming out of this river, you guys. And look at, already we just about got our cart full. What the heck was that? Oh, another piece you got. Whoa, dude. Look at this thing, man. Looks like we got two bolts on there. But look at this, you guys. What do you think that is? We got some with a loop on here. I don't know if that's some kind of handle or what, but if you look at this end, it's got like a flat tip on it, almost like it's some kind of pry bar tool or something. That's kind of funky looking, you guys. What do you think that was used for? Hey, look it. You just caught one of the things I just caught. That's Only yours is like way smaller. Oh yeah, what? Look it. No it's the exact same type of thing, I think. Just so. Only maybe yours is missing the flat tip yeah, on there. Right. That is super weird, dude. What the heck do you think those are? I don't know. What the? Dude, look at what I just found, you guys. What the heck? I didn't even think there was anything on there because I couldn't even feel it. But look at, this is definitely the handle here. And this is like some kind of old, like a, like a what do you call it? A ballpoint hammer. Tink, 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 tink. Look at this. Whoa. <laughs> that thing is what tiny. The heck, <laughs> what the that heck would you even use that for? Weird looking. I have no idea, man. I mean, we are right next to these factories here, but I can't imagine right. what the heck would something that tiny of a hammer that be is, used for. That's hilarious. That's for like working on 
like little airplanes or something. I don't know, dude. That's, <laughs> that's weird. That's exactly what it is, man. <laughs> that is crazy, you guys. Maybe they were using the old hammer to work on the plane. I don't know, man. Super crazy. Yes, dude. Hey, look at that. <laughs> yeah, man. All right, you guys, this sun is pretty much gone. All the street lights are coming on, but check it out, you guys. We got, literally, we got stuff stacked up on the table here. We got stuff hanging all the way around the boat, you guys. The cart is full. And we found some pretty cool stuff, too, you guys. A little airplane, what the heck? We only had a couple hours, you guys, but we filled the cart right to the top, and we found tons of pretty cool stuff. Right now, I'm headed upriver to find us a spot to go magnet fishing. Other than these waves, you guys, it is absolutely gorgeous out here today. All right, guys, so we're going to head upriver here. I'm going to find us a spot to magnet fish, and we're going to see if we can find anything today. Check it out, guys. We are pulling up on the first spot we're going to be magnet fishing here. And look at what we got for depth here. It's like seven feet deep in there. Now, I did come here one other time in my kayak. Some of you guys might remember. Today, I got my large large 360 degree magnet with me. So let's get right down to it. Start tossing our magnet here today and see if we can find anything. Oh, the heck was that? Thought I felt something. Oh, no kidding. And I have something here, you guys. This is like my third throw. What the heck do we got here? First find of the day. Doesn't look like nothing too super crazy. Nope, definitely nothing too crazy, you guys. First find of the day. Looks like we got the old train track bolt. Just a little bit of cash money. Oh, I just like heard something click. There's gotta be something on there. Doesn't really feel like it, but I sure heard something. And I can't quite tell. A uh, little something. What the heck is that? Hey, look at this, you guys. At first, I was going to say maybe just a little piece of rebar, but look at the way that kicks out. That almost looks like a big old heavy-duty kickstand. Maybe off of a big mountain bike or something, but holy cow, that almost looks like a, like a motorcycle kickstand. That thing is thick. Huh. Oh, something just like smacked, buddy. Oh my gosh, I'm like pulling it right up out of the mud. Whoa, what the heck is this, you guys? Whoa, what in the world is that? Holy cow, man, looks like we caught the whole plumbing system. The old train track plumbing system. Why the heck would something like this even be out here? It's not like train tracks need plumbing or anything. Again, nothing super crazy, you guys, but a little bit of cash money wait for the cart. Oh. There's got to be all kinds of stuff in here. This area is super secluded, man. So if you were ever thinking of trying to dump something in a place where nobody's going to see you, this would be one of them places. What do we got on there? Oh, you guys, look at that is a railroad spike. But I'm looking at this thing. I don't know what the heck that is. First, I thought it was a stick, and now I have no clue. All right, you guys, we got our first railroad spike at the railroad tracks. How many of these suckers do you think we're gonna find today? Cash money. Oh, what is that? I just grabbed something, dude. Like, picked it right up. Oh no, it's gonna come off. No, come on. Come on, pull. Oh no, it is coming up. Oh, I got it. Whoa, what is this? Dude, hold on a second. 
Whoa, you guys, nah, -uh. no way, man. Look at what this is. This is one of them big old railroad pry bars. But look at, you can tell it's got like that hexagon shaped shaft on there, man. You guys, I've only found one of these ever. Now this is my second one. Dude, super cool, you guys. You got some leverage on that puppy. <laughs> Oh, I think we just, we definitely just grabbed something, you guys. Or maybe not. What the, what the heck is going on there? Oh no, there's definitely something on there. That got heavy right away. What the heck do we got here? Oh, look at that one, you guys. Again, we caught some more railroad evidence. This one's one of them big old railroad clamps or some kind of clip. What is that? Oh, nice and slow. Oh my gosh, that's actually coming up out of the mud all of a sudden. Dude, no way. What is this? Holy cow. Whoa. Dude, is this like some kind of door? No way, you guys. Alex found something almost just like this at a railroad, I wanna say maybe eight, nine, 10 months ago. His, I don't think you could actually read the words on there, but look at this one, man. It's the same kind of deal. It's definitely some kind of door here. You can see like this is the hinge. And what does that say on there? National something, you guys, I can't really tell. National co coiler spring? National Coiler Spring, maybe that's what that says. I can't really tell. So I wonder if this is like a coal door where you flip this thing open and shovel some coal in there. I don't know, man. Either way, that is super cool. And look at some of the rust is starting to peel up there. So I bet you we could get this cleaned up pretty good so we could actually read it nice. Oh, right here. Right here, buddy. That does not want to move. Oh my goodness, what the? Now you can feel it. Oh, no, 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 it's coming. Oh, I got it. That did not want to come up at first. Then we just sucked it up out of the mud. Look at that thing, hold on. Let me uh, wash off some of the mud here without trying to lose it. Oh, no, we're gonna lose it. Oh no, I got her, I got her, okay. What the heck is this one, man? Dude, no way. Are you actually serious right now? Look at this, you guys. Is that not like another door panel looking piece? Like the old coal furnace door? And look at, there's like some more writing on this one down at the bottom. I definitely can't tell what that one says. It looks like almost the exact same kind of deal as this one. Yeah, it's like the same thing. feel something there. It's kind of in like the same area we just found that second coal furnace door or whatever that is. Here we go, a couple of things sticking off there. You guys, look at railroad spike number two. I'm surprised we haven't found more already. And look at this one, you guys. We got us the old railroad clamp. This one's a little bit different than uh, the other style that we caught. Like this one, they're definitely like the same kind of deal. Two different clips. All right, you guys, we got us some more railroad cash money evidence. Oh, right there. I just grabbed something and it's coming up. Heck yeah, dude. Whoa, 
You guys, wait, whoa! No way, man. Look at, first of all, we got us our third Cash Money Railroad Spike. But you guys, look at this, man. We caught us one of them gigantic meat-looking hooks. I've never found these by a railroad, and as a matter of fact, I don't think I've ever even found them anywhere else but this specific river. So that is super funky, man. Look at that. Unreal. Oh, that's got some weight to it for sure. As soon as I lifted that sucker up. Oh, dude, <laughs> you guys, look what's hanging on the side of there, man. We caught us up pliers. Heck yeah, dude, and that thing's not even really busted up. It's just a little rusty. 100% definitely restorable. Heck yeah, you guys, free money. All right, guys, check it out. So we're starting to move down away from the railroad here. We're gonna just work our way down this shoreline here and we're gonna toss as we go. Really? No way, you guys. I'm literally pulling something my very first throw towards the shore here. Yup, holy cow, man, really? You guys, look at this thing here. At first, I thought this was just uh, some kind of scrap pipe or something, but uh, no, look at that. It almost looks like, like some kind of old school ore holder or something, or maybe a fishing pole holder. I have no clue. But we also had something else on there too. Look at this thing, you guys. What the heck do you think of that one? Whoa, look at on the inside there. There's like some kind of mechanism going on there and this almost looks like a lever. Like maybe some kind of locking mechanism. I don't know what to think of that one, you guys. Oh, shut up, look it. That's like a door latch where you would close the door and this part would lock in there. You gotta be kidding me. That's crazy, man. Look at that thing. the heck is that we just hooked on to we're not that far out here but we kind of are pretty far from the shore i would think at least to throw something anyway whoa dude whoa what the heck dude it's like some kind of rim it definitely is you guys look at this thing it's like too big to be a bike rim but it's like too small to be a car rim what the heck is that i see no traces of rubber left on there there's no spokes or nothing i don't know we just got a, some kind of big old rim check that one out Oh, there is a little something on there, you guys. Look at where we are, man. I mean, there's nothing but a field here. I mean, there is houses over there, but it is just crazy the places that we find things, man. What the heck is this one? Look at that thing, you guys. There's definitely like some teeth on there. We got us the old something gear looking disc. Um, you guys, I'm floating down the river here, magnet fishing uh, the shore. And I think I see something that I don't want to be seeing right now. Dude, that's exactly what that is. No way. You gotta be kidding me. I can't even show that on camera. You guys, if you have a weak stomach, you might want to turn this off or look away. That is literally a full-size dog right there. I'm not even kidding you. Yeah, I definitely cannot show this on camera, you guys. Oh my gosh. I don't see a collar or any tags on there. What do I do, dude? 
Oh my goodness, I think I'm gonna be sick. You guys, I'm thinking maybe he fell through the ice and drowned during the winter and now he just ended up on shore because now it's spring. But at the same time, it is a little bit odd that it's like right at the dead end of this like street here. Hi, um, I'm not 100% sure if I made it to the right line, I guess, here, but uh, I am actually fishing right now from my boat, and I was floating down the river, and I seen a dead dog floating down the river, and uh, it's up on shore, and I don't know if it doesn't look like it has any tags on it or anything, but it looks like a, like a small German Shepherd or something. It's like somebody's house dog or something. Okay, sounds good. All right, thanks, Tyler. Yep, thank you. Bye -bye. All right, bye. I was, yeah. Where's it at? Right off the this yeah, landing. I didn't even to. I was just come check it out. Oh, okay. They're sending out cart right now. Yeah, I just talked to uh, animal control or something. Yeah, oh, that's right around the corner. Right yeah, there. you can kind of see it. Yeah, that's a shame. I know. I've never oh, ran into something like that before. Through the ice or something, maybe. That's what I was thinking. It looks like it's been a little while. Yeah. All right. Well, have a good day, man. Thank you, you too. Dog food, I don't Oh, know. yeah, no kidding. I didn't even notice that. There is dog food there. Somebody might give you a call. Uh, we might give you a call as far as our investigation team just to kind of, okay. you know, get an idea. Sure. I've got pictures on it and everything. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Yeah, it should be okay. Okay. Appreciate the call. Thank you. Yeah, definitely. Thanks for taking care of it. Have a good one. That was probably the most disturbing thing I think I've seen in quite a while. They said the investigation team is gonna keep in contact with me and let me know what they figure out. And we were looking around and on the ground we noticed a bunch of dog food. He even had like a chip detector that he swiped over the dog to see if the dog had a chip. He said he didn't find one. So I don't know how they can, I guess, finish the investigation. It's one thing if it was an accident, like the dog fell through the ice during the winter or something, but it's a whole nother story if that dog food on shore has something to do with I mean, somebody doing that. Not cool, man. So I'm definitely not gonna continue to magnifish after that, you guys. I'm gonna get the heck out of here, but we will be back. What is going on today, guys? Today, we are back out on the boat. I got Alex out here with me once again, and we are gonna be doing some more magnet fishing. Now, today, we don't have any specific plan, really. We're just gonna float down the river, and we might stop and magnet fish around some bridges, but we're gonna try to stay on the move today. As always, guys, there is just absolutely no telling what the heck we're gonna find. All right, guys, back out on the boat. Today, I have my large 360. 60 degree magnet with me. Let's get right down to it, start tossing, and see what we can find here today. What do you got? Uh, it looks like maybe low jack off of like Dude, a Dude, no, something. this is like a spider wire. This is, uh, oh, wire? you guys, alarm secure. This is, uh, is this is like for merchandise in stores so people don't steal it. Like an ink kind of a thing? Like this is, this would wrap around the product. Yeah, okay. And be locked together, yeah, and then if so you try to walk out with it, this something expensive because yeah, this probably costs yeah. like twenty bucks, right? So yeah, you know what's funny is I found two of those. They, I think they were different brands though, yeah. but I found them both on the other side of this bridge here. That's really? crazy. Now you found another one. Alarm secured. <laughs> That's cool, crazy, man. My head right. Oh, I, I just grabbed something. Oh, what the heck is this? It's coming up nice too, yeah. What do we got here, you guys? Oh, oh. whoa, whoa. Is there something in there too? Look at, there's like a glass bottle in here or something. Hold on, let me get this out. 
Whoa, dude. Oh, hold on a second. What is that? What is that? Blun. What does that say? Hold on a second, you guys. Holy cow. We'll check out this thing in a second. But first, I want to get this cleaned off and see what this little bottle says here. It says bluing. B-L-U-I-N-G. That's literally what it says. Something on the back, too. Something on the, oh. Something on the back, little, too? Little boy. Oh, no. Little, little, boy, little boy blue. Huh. Bluing. That actually sounds familiar. I'm Little boy lie. blue. I've never Let heard me of that. Google that real quick. Like right huh. now, I'm going to. Google That's pretty that. cool, man. And look at this bottle. It's it's in pristine condition. There's yeah, not right. a crack or a ding in it. Holy cow, man. We're gonna put this in this little pocket here so that sucker doesn't break. But check this out, you guys. I'm pretty sure this is like a hubcap, man. I'm almost positive. Yeah, look at that. What is this? Chevrolet? Chevrolet. No way. And I drive a Chevy too. So this this thing's definitely going on the wall in the garage, you guys. You guys, two super cool finds in one throw. Absolutely unreal. Oh, what the heck is that? I like immediately started clicking onto something. And I think I'm dragging it. Oh, and I just hit something else. Hold on. Let's see if I can put... Oh, here we go, dude. I got something. I got something heavy. I got something heavy. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, a couple things going on here, you guys. Looks like a big old triangle cutout piece of metal. Oh, hold on a second. Look at what's under there. It's like a part of a hammerhead. Oh, I do see that. Yeah. What the heck? Sure. What did you I catch? I recognize that. I caught myself a pipe here. No way, it yeah. is a pipe. For the recreational use. Ha ha ha. That's crazy. Yeah. Look at how rusty that is, man. That's that's probably been down there since My 60s. goodness. You got something, huh? Oh, hey, that's a big old... Look at dude, that's a big old disc like the one I caught, only yours is huge. I'm gonna hit my head. Look at this, you got a big old disc just like the one I caught, only mine is like tiny compared to yours. Yeah. That's it's crazy. Like, you think they're like manhole covers or I don't know. I don't know what those are. No, I don't think so. Is think it? So? No. Well, here, that's what I got this you for. See Use this. Bang some of that rust off of there or something. I don't know. I think that might. No, I don't think finish so. Finish it off. I don't think it is. I don't think so. If it if it is a sign, just be careful though. But that's that is literally what exactly what I bought that tool for right there to scrape some rust off of things like that and see what they are better. Oh, there is something on here. I didn't even feel anything. Whoa, whoa, what is that? After loading, close back and turn crank. Clockwise only direction arrow, eject film cover. Some kind of film cover. It looks like, oh, this is a film cover for a camera or something. Oh, okay. Like an old Polaroid or something. You could see the picture of the guy holding the camera on the back. Yeah. What the heck, That's man? Cool. That's kind of weird. You guys, I wonder if we pop this right off of the camera itself and if the camera is still down there or if this thing was just sitting down there by itself. And we had a little something else on there. Check this thing out, you guys. Looks like some kind of oval shaped plate or something. I can't really tell, but it almost looks like there's a little bit of blue paint on there. Hold on, I'm gonna try and get a, I'm gonna try and get a little closer, but I don't want to get too close. I don't want to smack. I see something with a label on it. See if I can throw my magnet on there. Boom! Grabbed her. Of course, my GoPro battery dies. But check this out, you guys. I found me an old tire changing jack, and it was literally just sitting on the shore. I doubt this one, I don't know, maybe it, it could be workable, but I don't think I would even trust it anymore.
I'm pulling something. Oh yeah, what the heck do I got here? Right off the backyards here, we got something. Dude, no. Look at, I'm gonna do me some gardening. <laughs> you guys, I caught me a whole rake. That's crazy, you guys, and look at the handle. It's dwindled right down to like a needle point. That's how you know this thing's been down there forever. Oh, hey, look at this. We could clean up the bottom of the boat. You know what, matter of fact, I'm gonna, oh snap. I should have expected that to happen. But look at it, now it's a little bit more sturdy. Now I can really rake some of this stuff up. Here we go. Oh, now we're talking. Push her all in the corner. Ha <laughs> ha, putting her to use already. Huh? <laughs> oh, that's a little something, I think. Got a little weight on there. Oh, yeah. Ooh, a couple things. Whoa. First of all, Look at this thing, you guys. Check it out, man. We got us the old hat hanger. And look at it, it's not just for one, it's for two. We got us the old double hooker. I think I'm like pulling something immediately. Ain't it? Uh, I can't really tell. Oh yeah, something on there, dude. No way. Look at what it is, you guys. Check this one out. We got us a big old pliers here. That one's rusted right shot. Look at that, dude. All right, you guys, I love finding tools. It's like free money. This one's cool. Oh, no it's way, like, um, man. Like, a, like an old... It's like a wagon wheel. Old, uh, the stroller, like one of those old... Oh yeah, like an old... bit. Yeah, though. oh, maybe. I grabbed something. You too? Oh, we're doubled up. <gasps> oh, shut up. Look at what I just found. You guys, I just found me an old ax. It's like it fully intact and everything. I can't tell if that's like- Tomahawk throwing It is like a tomahawk yeah. one. That's super cool. No way. Usually when we find something like this, you guys, it's like just the ax head or something. Chip out of the blade or Look at that. We could probably sharpen the blade up and make this thing like brand new. Sure. You can etch it with Fisher on the side. Unreal. <laughs> the old Bear grill survival axe. I don't know, I don't see any writing on there though, so this thing must be pretty old school. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that, yo. Oh, it's a shopping cart. But there's something in it. Holy cow. Hold on. Move the cup. Oh, don't lose it. Don't lose it. Ah! Dude, holy cow, man. Look at it. Unreal. Oh, that's what it was. I seen some blue in there. It's like a solo cup. I don't see any fishing lures in there or nothing though. Just a big old smashed up shopping cart. Holy cow. Oh, a couple things on here. Actually, it looks like a couple scrap pieces, maybe a little jar lid. And check this thing out, you guys. I don't know exactly what this is, but it looks like some kind of flashlight, maybe. I don't see a bulb in there, but there's like a little red, maybe a button on there. I can't really tell. And then what looks like a broken piece of a keychain. What the heck do you think that is? I think it says, what the heck does it say? Michael Putter and Ready to Rumble Inc. What the heck is that? Oh. 
Oh, here we go, dude. Heck yeah. What you got? This one. Oh, no way. For the boys. Check dude. that yeah. out. You going <laughs> fishing. Yeah, for sure. And look at all you need to do is attach this bad oh, boy. Yeah, you going yeah. fishing for show. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the tip is snapped off. Oh, but still, I it's like, yeah, it's probably just threw it in there after. <laughs> what do you got for a brand, though? It's like a Zepco or something. Yeah, you're Yo, gonna... Walmart brand. Oh, something on there. Look at this, dude. What the heck? What kind of little tool do you call this? A little extension wrench? Yeah, look at this. It's a 3A's extension. Is it a 3A's? Yes. How the heck do you know that just looking at it? Quarter inch, three You're eighths. too good. You're too good. You got mud all over your face, dude. You look like you. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you've been trekking through the jungle for 15 days. No idea. <laughs> we gotta get it. Dude, look at it. No, no, no. Come, no, come closer. No, yeah. No, turn that way. Oh, yeah, dude. Look at it. <laughs> I have no idea what the Yeah, heck the what the heck? You guys, my GoPro battery died, but check this out. He caught him like literally an entire exhaust piece here with the catalytic converter oh, on sure. there and I'm everything. What the value of something like that is. Well, I just brought in a catalytic converter recently and they told me, which is funny because a couple years ago they paid me for it. It was like 40, 50 bucks. Oh, okay. But this time they told me that they're not doing that anymore because of so much theft. <sighs> There's something here. No, I can't get, I'm like, it's in the mud. I'm playing with it, but I can't get it to come up out of the mud. Here it comes. Dude, no. Oh, it's slipping. Come here. I got part of it up out of the mud. Here it comes. Dude, I got it. Oh my goodness. Yo, is that another car hood? Come here. Dude, it's a car door. Oh my gosh. You guys, what the? No way. Cool. Holy cow, man. Oh my goodness, you guys. I literally caught an entire door. That just goes to show you how strong this magnet is. Look at that. I pulled that up with nothing but the magnet. Unreal, and what is this? Just a plastic tarp or something? Yeah, I thought that was like a bag of something for a second. Toyota, you see right there? It's a is Toyota it? Sun. Oh yeah, right here. You're not kidding. Look yeah. at you guys, Toyota. We got us the old Toyota door, and looking at this sucker, man, that's, wow, that's old. Look at that, you guys, what the heck? Prevea van or something. Here you go, hop in. Let's go for a ride. <laughs> you guys, what a find. We cost the old blue Toyota door. That's how you know right there that there is just no telling what you're gonna find. Oh, look who it is. Look at, oh, oh, watch out. Watch out, Frankie. Try to save your life, there he is. Look at him, come here, buddy. I got you. Come on, Frankie, I'm trying to save your life. Look at him, he's flipping and flopping. Get out of here. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Oh no. Right here. Something coming up. Heck yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, I see something shiny too. Oh, dude. That's a bike. Holy cow. Heck yeah. Look at what this is. Looking super old. Like a we caught us like the <laughs> oldest bike frame in the entire world. Look at that. Freaking not a bike, bike seat, up. not a handlebar, not a tire, not, not even a pedal. Nothing. It's the bike skeleton. What the heck, you guys? Look at that thing. And I seen a little something shiny. Look at what it is. I caught me a spoon now. This time around. Whoa. Oh, 
It's a, a spotlight. It's a headlight. For like a, it's a headlight for an old car, I like think. Like a Cherokee or something like that with the big bug lights. Holy smokes. That is super cool, man. That's got to be a, off a super old car. Yeah. Oh, I grabbed something right there. <laughs> yep. Holy cow, man. The amount of things in here is insane. Whoa. Oh, something fell off. I don't know what that was, but look at this thing, you guys. Look at the shape on that sucker. It's like some kind of some kind of old crank or something. I don't even know Speed what to think of that. What do you mean? Like, um, like on that extension that you found, that looks like that's a three eighth drive there. So that extension would have gone on there and you would take it and you would spin it. It's a little bit deformed, but you would take it and call it a spin. Like a hand before crank? They had, yeah, before they had like all electronic tools, this is how they did it with like fast. It would break it. Really? Like a wrench, grab the speed hand. Huh. And go, whoop, 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 whoop. Well, that's a pretty cool one, you guys. We caught us some kind of old hand crank tool. Super cool, man. What is that going on down there? Did we stick or what? Felt like I rolled something over or flipped something. I feel some weight though. I think it came with us. Oh, I see some green. Oh, what the heck is this, you guys? First of all, look at this, man. I caught me the old grill. There we go, grab your spoon, dude. We're cooking up some burgers today. Holy cow, you guys. I wonder if the whole rest of the grill is in there, but i seen some shiny old green on there, Buster. Look at this one. Now that's a nice shiny looking fish and lure. And again, just like the other fish and lure we caught, you guys, the hooks look like they're still good on there. You could slap that bad boy on the fishing pole that Alex caught and you're going fishing. I cannot believe some of the stuff we found today, you guys. A car door, and right next to it a couple videos ago, we found a car hood. I found me the old axe, you guys. We seriously found some cool stuff today. Now we have been absolutely killing it out on the boat in the last few videos, and I'm sure today is gonna be the exact same way. We're not gonna waste any time, guys. We're gonna get right down to it, start floating down the river, dragging these magnets, and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today. All right, you guys, back out here once again. I am feeling fantastic. Today we have our large 360 degree magnet. We're gonna try to stay on the move today as usual. Let's start dragging this magnet down the river and see if we can find find anything today. Oh my gosh, I just grabbed something. Yeah, right there. Whoa, what the heck is this? Oh, that's heavy. Oh my gosh. Whoa, dude, is this a couple things like mashed together? Or what is going on here? Hold on a second. Oh, oh, there we go. Check this one out, you guys. First of all, I don't know what this one might be. Look at that. There's definitely, I don't know, man. What do you think that's off of? Like a motorcycle or something? Dude, I don't have any clue. That's a weird looking one. Pretty cool. But we also had another something. And this one looks even crazier yet. Look at this thing, you guys. What the heck is that? There's like a, are they bearings maybe? Oh yeah, maybe. Like center support maybe. Like this would spin? Yeah, for a drive shaft. I think that's what that is. Holy cow, you guys. And again, this one too, looks like it would mount on something just like that. All right, you guys, we got us a super cool two for one here. Who knows what the heck these things are coming off of. You guys, check this out. That's definitely metal too. I'm gonna like hop out on shore here and try and grab this. I don't wanna smack the trolling motor. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Look at this thing right here, you guys. I see this like 
Oh man, that's, you guys, this thing is definitely way too wedged up under these rocks here. That's not gonna move, man, like no chance. But it looks like some kind of, you can see this is the base of it. There's some kind of stand under there. I don't know what that is. And it goes up under the rock under here. Huh, I don't know what the heck that thing is, you guys, but that thing sure is wedged right under the rocks. It's almost like it was there when the land and all the rocks slid because it is just stuck right under the ground. Oh, what kind of luck we're gonna get today? I got something. Ah, that one's got some weight to it, too. Everything I'm finding so far is super heavy. Whoa, whoa, look it. I found the Mac Daddy Crayfish Hotel. Now that's a pipe. Look at it, and nobody's home. Oh, I got something again. My goodness, it's back to back for me right now. You got something too? Whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want to lose mine. Dude, I, I thought it looked like a clock, honestly, or part of a clock because you could see like the inner workings. You can see a little gear in there. And on the back, I don't know what's going on here, but holy cow. Tick tock, tick tock. Super cool, you guys. And no doubt that is old as can be. What a find. I just landed right on something, man. Holy cow. My luck today is like something else. And it's all heavy stuff. Yeah, here we go. Hold on, don't crash. What do I got here? Come on. Whoa, dude, holy cow. Look at all them things on one throw, you guys. Wait a minute, look at You guys, we had three things attached here, but look at these two look like the exact same piece. And it almost looks like maybe the stand of something. I don't really know, like the, the feet of something. Who really knows? But then we also had this on there too. And I don't know what the heck to think of this one. Oh, at the playground, they got those scoops. In the oh, stand. yeah, it kind of does look yeah. like a little scoop, <laughs> like a little playground scoop. There is some crazy stuff in this river, you guys. Boom. Oh yeah, something right here. And it's coming up, but it doesn't feel, it feels like it wants to slip off. Nice and easy. Oh no. No, no, no. It's still on there. It's still on there. Or no, what the heck is going on? <laughs> Whoa. You guys, look at that throw, man. Look at all them, what are the nails? They're just like little metal sticks look at that and look at what else was attached to the side i'm pretty sure that's like an old school bike pedal what the heck man i guarantee you all of this little stuff is making it hard to click onto anything big down there whoa dude whoa look at this thing i just found it's like a piece of wood with a bunch of different rungs or like different rings on there what the heck do you guys think that one could have came off of like an old buggy or an old carriage or something who knows the old wooden ring pistol non-stop back to back with some heavy stuff here whoa yo whoa, dude. <gasps> is that a whoa. propeller yes it is no uh, 
No way! Holy cow, you guys! Yeah, that's a big prop. Like, 300 horse or something. compared to my prop, this is like three times the size. I've said this a couple times, and I'm not sure if back in the day they used to float like big ships down this river, but this thing here sure looks like it would be off of a big ship, man. Super cool, dude. And it looks like we had a couple other things on there, maybe a little piece of scrap and the old scrap pipe. What the? Oh my! What the heck is this? Uh, dude, it's like moving. Oh my! Hold on. Oh yo! It is moving, dude. What is that? Uh, hold on. Hold on a second. Oh. Oh, here it comes. I think I just popped it out of whatever it was wedged in. Yeah. What the heck is that? Oh, what the thing it is. Hold on a second. Oh, dude, you know what this is? This is a boat fin. Alex keeps hooking onto something massive over there. Now keep in mind, we just pulled out this big old boat propeller. And now I pull out the fin that like you, well, this is what the steers it. Size. Oh. Oh, that's not, that's not coming up. No. I mean, yeah, you can kind of feel it, but whatever that is, it's not coming up. Huh. A little something here. Ooh, dude, no way. Look at what I just found, you guys. The big old shovel head. Unreal, man. I am absolutely floored right now by some of the stuff we're finding. This is so cool. We got the old scooper. Oh my gosh. You guys, check this out. You guys, first of all, look at this thing sitting here. Whoa, what is this? Oh, it's like stuck by a string. Dude, whoa. What the heck is that? It's like some kind of, I don't know. Is that a flower design on there? I can't really tell what that is. Almost looks like a belt or a headband or something. I can't really tell here. But you guys look at what I seen sitting on shore here. Check it out. We got the old scoot scoot. <laughs> you guys, look at this. Let's check it out. Wah, wah, wah. We can even do tricks out here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no way, man. You guys, there's just all kinds of stuff everywhere around here. Taxi, taxi, come pick me up. Pick me my new pink scooter up, please. Unreal. Oh, hold on a second. I see something sticking out of the water across the river over here. You guys, I think I know what it is too. Let's go check it out. Yup, you guys, you see that thing sticking out of the water? I'm pretty sure that's exactly what I think it is. I guarantee you this is a basketball hoop, dude. Yup, or not a basketball hoop, but a backboard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even think that's gonna come out. How am I gonna get that? Oh my gosh. Are we gonna wiggle it out of the mud here? I don't know. Oh, I think it's coming. It's coming, dude. <laughs> I don't know, it's kind of still stuck in the mud though. No, it's like a whole pole and everything. Oh, you guys, holy cow. It's literally a whole basketball hoop. Like not even kidding you, look it. <laughs> what in the world, man, what's next? Oh, I got it. That is the whole base, yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. The whole base is on there and everything. You gotta be kidding me. I don't even know how we're gonna get this thing on here. Come on, come on. Uh, I got it, dude. Now that is the definition of you don't know what the heck you're gonna find when you go magnet fishing. Look at the base and everything, dude. An entire flipping basketball hoop, you guys. What the heck? You guys, this is one of them finds here that is just way too big to be hauling around on the boat, but there is a big old empty parking lot right at the top of this hill here. We're gonna drop this thing off here and we'll have to pick it up with the truck before we leave today.
Look at this, thought I just had some scrap, but I see a little handle. Dude, is that for an old fork? Oh my gosh, you guys, look at, there's only one of the prongs left on there. Holy cow, now that's gotta be an old fork, dude. This is the first fork ever made. Unreal, you guys. Oh my gosh, I sucked it right up. Or did I? No, no, we're slipping. Whoa, dude. Oh my goodness. It's coming up. It's coming up. Oh, dude, what the? Oh my gosh, there's a bottle. There's a bottle attached to it. What the heck, dude? You guys, look at this bottle is literally attached to the side of this thing. And I think it's just rusted right to it. That's not even coming off. I could try, oh yeah, look at, I just broke it here. Here's a toast, a toast to the magnet fishing. You guys, what the heck, man? I don't know if that's just a big old wine bottle or like an old liquor bottle or something, but look at, this looks like a big old, uh oh, here goes some of it, whoops. This looks like a gigantic manhole cover or something. I think that's exactly what it is too. Unreal, you guys, we caught us an entire manhole cover maybe it's an old school one or something because i'm pretty sure the new ones are even heavier than that oh that might not have been good i definitely just broke that rock i caught the thing i was trying to grab though but hopefully i didn't just bust up my magnet dude oh come here what the heck is this thing now that I just might have broken my magnet for. Look at this. Is that like some like a control arm type deal on there? Look at this thing, you guys. I don't know what to think of this thing 100% for sure, but it does look like uh, it would flex here and it sure looks like it might be something automotive. I don't know, you guys. Man, look at this cart already. We are literally just back to back finding some super cool stuff today. Oh, dude, no way, no way. Look at you guys, hold on. Let me get these two things off of here. Oh, and no way. Look at, first of all, there's a spark plug on there. But look at you guys, I got one brake pad and boom, we got two brake pads. And you guys, look at, these two brake pads are different sizes. And look at that, there's still a little bit of brake left on there. Oh, look at what's on there. What? Look at, whoa. Oh, another brake pad. Dude, you got two. I see two on there. You got two more brake pads just like I caught. Look at you guys. I caught me two brake pads. I got a fat one and a skinny one. And That's same thing for you. You got a fat one and a skinny one. Look at, we can fix a whole vehicle <laughs> up with some new brakes. Four different pads. <laughs> <laughs> Holy smokes. Here we go. Whoa, dude, whoa. What is that? At first I was, I thought I was catching part of a shopping cart. Then again, maybe that is part of a shopping cart, you guys. Look at that, is that like the bottom rack off of a shopping cart? I don't even know, hard to tell. Some kind of cage looking piece. Help, help, I'm locked up. 